Hello everyone! So, today I have something a little bit different for you guys uh, because something arrived in the mail today. I actually sent uh, a message, an email, an inquiry about these, uh, the Final Fantasy uh, trading cards um, to the Australian distributor way back in, in like November. Um, and he did say he would, he would send me some cards um, for review, which is what I'm going to do. I'm going to unbox in this video and then I'll, I will uh, do a proper review on the cards and the card game itself. Um, he just didn't have any stock and uh, and it got around to December, sort of didn't hear. And anyway, it arrived today and what I was expecting was like a pack, like a lightning pack or a, a Final Fantasy X pack, not <laughs> like all three starter sets, uh, three booster packs, and uh, this really, really awesome um, Sephiroth promo card. I was not expecting that. Uh, that Sephiroth is amazing. Um, so, what I'm going to do now is unbox the booster packs and see what we got, because they're, they're going to be the exciting ones. Uh, I will unbox one of these. There's no point in doing all of them, because they're all pre-made decks. Alright, so let's go first up with one of the boosters, and I do have another camera set up here. It's an awful setup, but hopefully it'll do. One thing I do have to say about these cards is they feel fantastic. Like, I, I've, I'm a big card game fan, I played Hearthstone. I'm, I play Hearthstone now, but I've played Yu-Gi-Oh! in the past, and I've collected Dragon Ball Z cards, and I've played Pokemon in the past, like, semi-professionally at, at championships and stuff. Um, and these cards feel way better quality. They're like, uh, like that really nice poker card feel, the slippery feel. So we've got a Bard, Samurai, Evoker, Black Mage, Hate Sith. That's very cool. I like that. Another Evoker, but this one is a different energy type or typing. Um, and I will explain more about the actual card game in the proper review. As it, again, this is just a unboxing. Dragoon. Oh, I got a very special Evoker. Uh, I believe that all of the cards, um, all of the cards have a foil version, so you can get foil versions of any card out there. Another Kate Sith, which is another cool... Ah, look! Vincent! Yes! Vincent is one of my all-time favorite characters just because he is so goddamn cool. Sylph and Kefka. So that is the first pack unboxing. I've got a cool foil there, a couple of Kate Siths. So this is a very uh, Final Fantasy VII. Um, focus pack that one. So let's move into the next booster. I see another foil already. Okay, a knight, a ranger, chocobo. Red Mage, Archer, Monk, Viking. Ah, oh, that is so cool. A awesome foil terror. Leviathan, Duke Lark, the Brunhilde, Brynhilde, and the Emperor. That was a cool pack as well. Alright, let's move on to the last pack. I don't know, I've never really done unboxings, um, but for stuff like this, it's definitely something that I want to do, because um, you're getting my reactions straight up. Obviously, I haven't opened any of these, so uh, yeah. Let's hope for something awesome in this last pack. Magus. 
a dancer. Ah, Tama, that's awesome. I didn't see, I didn't know they already got World of Final Fantasy um, in these packs. That's amazing. Yuffie, Yuffie, how do you guys say Yuffie? Do you say Yuffie or do you say Yuffie? I've always said Yuffie. That's what it looks like in English. A summoner, a magus, a monk. A mime, a shiny mime. Uh, that'll be the first mime I've got, I think, I believe, and it's a shiny one. Mustardio. Cecil, Cecil. I always say Cecil. How do you guys say Cecil? Is it Cecil or Cecil? I always say Cecil. Sid and Kimahari. Or Kim Kimari. See, I, I've pronounced that wrong. It's definitely Kimari. So that was all of those. That was all of the booster packs, and I will just quickly do one of the starter decks to show you kind of what's in a starter deck. They're not ex they're not, obviously not as exciting as the booster packs because the booster packs have all the rare stuff that you don't get in starter decks. Also, uh, if you want to have a quick look at that Sephiroth card, it is um, very, very cool. I don't know how this is going to look. Yeah. That Sephiroth card is amazing. Alright. Let's go. One of these starter decks. I'll do the FF10 one. So in every starter deck, you get the start guide, which is how to play the game, obviously. Very important. You get a play mat. Whoa. Hey, you get a playmat. Obviously for playing. In every starter deck, and obviously each of the three starter decks, there's a Final Fantasy 13, a Final Fantasy 10, and a Final Fantasy 7 starter pack. They all come with different stuff. Well, they all come with different cards, sorry. So they both come with the starter set of their starter guide and the uh, and the other stuff and the playmat, but all the cards are different. So I'll just give you guys a quick run through here. So this is it's basically, the starter decks are like structure decks in Yu-Gi-Oh! and stuff like that. It's it's basically, this is a pre-made deck. It's 50 cards, you need 50 cards to play, and you can play with this deck as is. But obviously it's not going to be the most powerful deck in the world because it doesn't have a lot of rare cards. So if you buy a bunch of boosters, you can start replacing these cards. So you can say, oh, well... You know, um, pain isn't, uh, what is pain? See, I, I'm not 100% sure of all the powers, but you could say, oh, well, I don't really like pain, it's not that powerful, I'll switch it out and I'll put Sephiroth in there. Or I'll put somebody, I'll put something else in there. So you can start switching them out. It's, uh, they're, they're very good for if you're starting a game, especially a sort of a new card game, um, because you can just replace cards with other similar cards that are just more powerful rather than starting from scratch and learning all the intricacies of deck building straight from the beginning. Alright, that was my unboxing guys. I will be back shortly soon. I will do a proper review um, and that will be on the actual cards themselves and also the actual game itself. Thanks for watching everybody. Hit that like button subscribe comment everything else I'm on a six day schedule now so that's new videos pretty much every day of the week um, I'll be fully into the groove of that by the end of January other than that guys I'll see you all soon